announcement came over the hospital system saying an active shooter is on the seventh floor. You went into the hospital that day with a loaded gun. How could you think that that is okay? Looking back and then to a terrifying lockdown, many people won't forget the man who pulled a gun in the neonatal unit at Children's Hospital one year ago is sentenced. The incident involving this man, Ashanti Hendricks, prompted changes in how police respond inside hospitals. WISN 12 News' Colleen Henry reports the man who sparked the incident is expressing remorse. Hospital cameras captured Milwaukee police arriving at the neonatal unit last year to look for a man who was visiting his newborn. The suspect had an outstanding warrant and a history of carrying a gun. Moments later, a different camera captures the suspect as he runs. Burst through a staff door, gun in his right hand, police in pursuit. Officers eventually shot Ashanti Hendricks in the hand before arresting him. Today, one of those police officers told the judge Hendricks dropped his own baby to go for his gun. When asked for cooperation from police, he chose the firearm over the baby. The judge heard about Hendricks' own childhood, how he was bumped from one foster home to another. She heard pleas for mercy from the mother of Hendricks' baby. I feel like he should be given another chance at life and fatherhood. From Hendricks' own mother. I said it's all my fault. <laughs> For not being the best parent, best mother that I could be. 23 year old Hendricks offered apologies. The MPD and every other patient and every other parent that was there, and my intention never was to hurt anybody or try to put anybody in danger. You went into the hospital that day with a loaded gun. How could you think that that is okay? In the end, the judge sentenced Hendricks to five years in prison to be served once he finishes a different felony sentence. He's also required to take parenting classes. In Milwaukee, Colleen Henry, WISN, 12 News.